I mean, legacy fund's not even an option, is it? Really? Uh, legacy fund, uh, right around $11 billion right now. Um, we use what we call a percent of market value to determine how much of the fund that we're going to use. And that's about 3.5% per year based on a five-year rolling average. So in a biennium, somewhere between 500 and $600 million is what becomes available. $100 million of that right now goes towards a bond issue. The state borrowed uh, $680 million, I think, at 2% uh, a few years ago. One of the best bargains that we've ever done. Uh, we're earning more in interest than we are paying on our bond, and we also got some infrastructure projects funded prior to the inflation factor. So it was a win-win from those aspects. Uh, we put $100 million into the highway fund. Um, and we've used about 225, I think, for tax relief already. And so effectively, we could probably come up with somewhere between 150 and $200 million out of the legacy fund. Uh, I always say when we look at the legacy fund earnings, what we do with it is a reflection of what the people have asked for. We use it to pay operating expenses for the state so that we don't have to levy taxes to do that. We use it for infrastructure projects that we'd have to levy taxes for in order to build. And some of it we put back into the legacy fund to increase the, the principal for the long term. I think that's a very prudent and it's a very smart way of managing the revenue streams that we have coming off of that.